welcome to the vlog. If you are new here, I'm Krista, and today we are getting a post-COVID slash new mom glow up. Basically, I'm getting a COVID makeover today, and it is much needed because I have not had a haircut since before COVID started, so last February, which makes that over a year. So here's the before. Milk break. We had a hungry baby. So today I am going to get my hair cut for free. I will tell you how I get it for free in a little bit. But first we're just going to have a little makeover and I'm going to do some things to spruce myself up and have a COVID glow up. We'll see how much I get to, but let's get into the video. Part of my glow up is working out because not only do I like to keep my muscles strong, but it also just makes me feel good. I haven't been working out for the past couple weeks because I just had a baby, but now we're four weeks out, so I'm easing back into working out and just doing little exercises. So let's work out. I just wanna get you on my grid sometimes, on my grid sometimes. to this because Spencer got me this product for Christmas but I haven't been able to use it because it wasn't pregnancy safe but it is breastfeeding safe so we're doing a peel. It's this AHA BHA peeling solution from The Ordinary and it looks kind of scary because it's like red so let's try it out. I'm also going to put on some whitening strips because why not? So here's the before of my teeth. Uh oh. This is already turning into the most real mommy makeover ever because he does not want me to be away from him, <laughs> which is just fine. Anyways, we'll see if I get to any of the makeover. <laughs> it's okay. Okay, the new name of this video is an attempt at doing anything for yourself with a newborn baby. <laughs> um, so now we have like an hour, so I'm going to I don't know, should I even do the peel? <laughs> I don't know. We're just gonna go into overdrive and see how much we can do. <laughs> Let's do it. Ha, huh. I just read this and it says leave the strips in place for one hour, so we're not doing this. <laughs> also, this seems pretty hardcore. I feel like it's not the kind of thing that you want to do really quickly and mess up, so I'm also gonna save this for later. <laughs> But I am going to take a second in my mommy makeover to go to the bathroom. So there you go. Ah, nothing like doing your skincare while on the toilet. I wouldn't be rushing through all this if I didn't have an appointment at a certain time. Um, it's just that I have to like get to that appointment and feed him before I go. So it's a little complicated. It's usually not this chaotic. All right, let's do some quick makeup. Oh, I was also going to get my eyebrows done as a part of this video. I usually go to a place that does threading and they are so good and it's so cheap. I think it's like, it's either five or $8 for your eyebrows. Um, I'll link it down below if you're in the same area as me. I highly recommend. They are so good because they really leave your brows like natural and somewhat bushy looking. At least that's what I asked for and they have always done a great job. But then I looked at my brows and I was like, I think they're okay, even though I haven't been in a year. So we're gonna skip that today, but let's do some makeup. My original plan was to like put together a really cute outfit for my COVID glow up. But first off, I was gonna wear a dress and it's like so stormy slash like, then it's sunny but mostly stormy outside. So I'm like, maybe not. And also um, there's not time. So I think I'm just going to focus on putting on a pair of pants that doesn't have a dishwasher detergent stain on it. <laughs> Is it a stain if it's made out of soap? Who knows? Anyways, let's let's get an outfit. Ready? One, two, three. Ta-da! Okay, I admit it. I didn't put on new pants. I just blotted out the dishwasher stain with a face towel. I'm disgusting. 
So here is my glow up OOTD. <laughs> Not bad, if I do say so myself. I think it's time to feed the baby. Okay, it's time to go. My mom and dad are going to watch him. Good luck. <laughs> I better get a kiss. Goodbye, baby. Have fun. Okay, off we go. It is a rainy. Let's go get a haircut. An important part of any glow up is healthy snacks, which is why I brought these Cheetos. Okay, we made it up to Seattle. Let's talk hair. So like I said before, I haven't had my hair cut in over a year, so I've been looking forward to this. So today I'm gonna get the mom haircut. Aha, <laughs> just kidding. Uh, today, actually what I'm gonna do is basically just get the same cut as before. It's so funny because I usually have layers. I like to get them to like here, but look. This is my shortest layer right now. So it definitely needs a cut, hoping to get some volume that's going. Today we are going to Finza Salon. And here we are in beautiful Seattle. Um, disgusting. <laughs> There's just hair. <laughs> Let me get this off. <laughs> I just realized that was all super zoomed in. So, here's my hair. Uh, very exciting. Yes, the bangs. Um, also, I wanted to explain how we did this. So, for like the past, I don't know, forever years, I've been getting free haircuts. And how I do that is I get them from students. And you might think like, oh no, a haircut from a student? Like, ooh. But the thing is, is that um, the lady who cut my hair today, she was fantastic and she's a student at this salon, but she's already completed all of her training for to be a hairstylist. Um, so then when these people come to a new salon, they have to do the salon training. So even though they already have all their training, they also have to learn the ways of the salon. So it's not scary. It's not like, oh my gosh, who's going to be cutting my hair? Oh, except for one time I went to this person who cut like a V in my bangs. It was really bad. But yeah, it's not scary. It's super fun. You get to meet like a lot of new people. They always do a great job for the most part. And yeah, I've never had like a horrible experience. So I found this haircut by looking on Craigslist. That's usually how I'm able to get my haircut for free. You just go in on Craigslist and type in free haircut and search under services or gigs, or you can search for a hair model and you'll usually find something. It might take like a couple weeks of looking, but I've always been able to find one. So that's super fun. Now that things are starting to get back to normal, I should be able to get my hair cut more often. Yay. Okay, we gotta get home. Goodbye, Seattle. I'm home and I have my hair cut. I'm also feeding a hungry baby for the second time. So if you are a mom and you've had a failed mommy makeover like this, or if you are just a normal person and you actually had a COVID glow up, go ahead and tell me down in the comments. I think I'm going to end the video right here because, well, this is my glow up. This, this baby is all the glow that I need. <laughs> Hit the like button, subscribe, and I will see you next week in a different video. Bye!
looking good. It's more purpley. Less blood-like now. That's good. squeaky clean and shiny so that's good also still not a fan of the bangs hopefully they grow fast good morning guys welcome to the vlog if you are new here my name is Kristen <laughs> oh. You, I feel so much better, oh, yeah Before you, I was just a shell So stuck in the dark, dark. 